It's really easy to tell somebody else, hey, just trust in the Lord. But when you don't have a paycheck, or when you're battling depression, or when you feel all alone, how do you trust in God at that moment? And David says this, I hope this builds your faith. He says, the Lord is a refuge for the oppressed. If you feel hurting, if you feel alone, if you feel oppressed, the Lord is a refuge for you. Then scripture says this, those God who know your name, trust in you. What do you call God? Well, what you call someone really, really matters because what you call someone tells us a lot about the relationship. How do you grow in your trust to God? You get to know his name. You get to know his character. My strength, come quickly to help me. Who are you, God? You are my strength. Paul said in the New Testament that whenever you're weak, whenever you don't have enough strength on your own, whenever you're vulnerable, whenever you're hurting, Paul said whenever you are weak, God's strength is made perfect in you. In, in other words, every time you have a weakness, you also have an opportunity to experience God's strength. Give God your weakness. When you give him your weakness, he will give you his strength, who is God. You are my strength. Growing up, I thought God was my God. He wasn't my God. He was my pastor's God, but he wasn't my God. He was my grandmother's God, but he wasn't my God. I went to college and maybe like many of you, I, I, I got kind of wild. I, 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 you could say I was majoring in sinning and my life completely fell apart. I found myself addicted to alcohol, tried to stop and passed out one night with my head hanging over the edge of a very busy road. And I got so, so low. So I tried to pray, but I realized I was praying to a God I did not know. And a gentleman from an organization known as the Gideons gave me a little green Bible. And I started to read it. And suddenly God was not a distant, far off God that someone else knew, but I started to call on him for myself. And he changed me. He loved me. He became my God. Do you feel anxious today? Are you hurting? Do you feel afraid? Call out on God as if he were your God. Call out on him. Cry to him. If you're hurting today, just tell him you're hurting. If you're mad, unload on him. I promise you, he can handle it. I am, I am convinced that God would rather you yell at him than to walk away. How do you trust in him when you feel alone, when you feel anxious and afraid? Those who know his name find it easier to trust his heart.